Next on the list of maintenance tips is the main playing slide of a trombone. Now, with a trombone, that is the most important part. If it's not moving smoothly, you're not going to be playing efficiently. So keeping it well maintained is hugely important. With this one, what I like to do might be different from what other people like to do, but here are a few top tips that might keep your playing slide in tip-top condition. I've got the JP231 Raff Antique Finish. This is our new antique finish that's back in stock now. I've got the main playing slide here. So, this one needs a bit of work. I would take the main outer slide off, noting that actually this is the most important part of the instrument. So taking real good care of this is, is hugely important, making sure that you're not in an overly crowded space and you have lots of room to be able to, to do this. What I'm going to do first of all is I'm just going to pop the outer slide away from me on the floor. First and foremost is, is cleaning the grime or the grease or the, the lubricant that you've already got on there off. Again, a bit of kitchen roll, if you have lighter fluid or something like that that will help degrease it, that's great. Cleaning those inner slide legs, making sure, paying special attention to the stockings down at the bottom where the slides uh, flare a little bit, making sure that that's nice and clean. Doing this with slightly warm soapy water might be useful as well. I'm going to pop that down on the floor now as well. Moving on to the outer slide, there are a few options that you can, can use here. One of them is uh, a bendy snake. This one is a, a Helen bendy snake that can go down through there. Again, this is cleaning all of the grime that's on the inside of the outer playing slide. The other options are a slide rod. Now these are great for really going up and down but you can't get around the bend at the bottom where some of that grime will uh, kind of puddle or pull. Uh, with that you also have a couple of options. These are the slider mix cleaning sheaths. Different colours for different bore sizes. So we've got the red for a medium bore, so a smaller bore size instrument and the blue for a large bore. I'm not going to use these today. What I'm going to do is what our brass repairer showed me. Again, trusty piece of kitchen roll. And I put this into a nice neat square. Again, you can use lighter fluid to help with the degreasing. On this cleaning slide rod, there's a small loop at the top. Thread that kitchen roll through, wrap it around, making sure that you're protecting the metal bit at the end. Make sure it's really nice and tight. And then what you can do, once that's ready, you can then, I have not wound it tight enough, but you can go up and down the inner slides, or the outer slide I should say, making sure that that's nice and clean. Great, you've sorted all of that out, now on to the next step. I would get both parts of the slide together again. Again, this is how I would do it, lots of people would do it differently, making sure Got nice and comfortable. I'm going to use Champion Slide Easy, slide lubricant. Lots of people like the, the slider mix, rapid comfort. There's the all-in-one option. There's the, the two-part bottles of the slide additive and so on. And do a little bit around here at the bottom. This one's quite gloopy. And it might be a bit stringy. A bit more on the other side as well. Making sure that we're all good there. Now if I just go up and down like this, it's not going to be coating the entire inner slide of the trombone. So I'm going to take it out again, put one slide leg in, and again spin it around making sure that it's coating all of the inside. Similarly on the other leg as well, making sure that it's all coated. Pop the slide back in, and then using trombone water spray. I'm using the Edgeware here by Brass Band Instrument Company. You can just use a normal water spray as well, giving it a nice dousing of water. The water reacts with the lubricant and makes it really nice and smooth and you're all good to go.